Double Dragon. It's your boy Amen's. Like it. Back with some new heat for y'all today. You heard what she said. Get it. Alright. Bow one piece. What's good, y'all? What y'all eating on, man? You ever drove past and you saw a kid in the car and he's staring at you and you just gave him like a crazy look? Like, like that or something? The situation happened. I don't know if I gave him a crazy look, though. I just stared. I had a couple of stare offs. I never did anything mean like like this, but I always wanted to. Like, why are you all in my car? Like, I was probably like picking my nose or something. You all up in my car. Crazy. You messed up. I was at the restaurant one day. There was this family sitting on the left of us. They was giving each other hugs goodbye. And one of the kids, like a little white kid, was hugging his like grandpa goodbye. And we kind of locked eyes. And I was like this to him like just being funny like give me a hug too and he looked at me like as he should he was a stranger yeah but i was like dang <laughs> you're gonna go to jail man you need to stop doing stuff <laughs> what if one of your parents got offended or something they laughed their whole family laughed they white their whole family laughed it's like it's more like a joking stuff like it's like my, my personality once i'm talking people don't see like i'm being harmful or nothing it's like a, it's like a jokey thing like... <laughs> <laughs> got the world for you right here yeah we back man um we got the plans now revolutionary army is finally like making a stance they making their attack it's the goal declaring war like how do you like i don't understand it gotta be a reason behind them actually declaring it i guess to i guess when you're doing a revolution you want as many people to know as possible so i could see that reason of, of, of at least declaring it because i'm pretty sure celestial dragons are gonna be there so i think they're doing that to kind of declare so the world can wake up because if they do it by themselves then they probably won't get as much support so i guess it makes sense i was wondering like why why even say it but yeah. I'll probably answer my own question. It seemed like it was the whole goal from the beginning. And Dragon was like, now it's time yeah. to do it. Been waiting for it. Damn. I'm excited, man. Y'all know I don't like the world government. Besides a few, a few people, Kobe, a mm -hmm. couple of people liking like T Bone. Um... Well, what you mean, a couple people liking like? A couple of people why, that you Why, why you had to add that in there? A couple people that you express to like. What's wrong? That's a why fact. You to add, why you had to add mine in there? Why you had to do that? You said, oh, I don't like the world government besides a couple people I like. And you said Kobe, then you said, then a couple people like him like. Why, well, why you had to add that in there? Why can't you just stay on what you like or dislike? My bad, I ain't mean to bring you in that. I'm just asking. There's a couple people um, that I like. T-Bone. Saw. Of course, Kobe. That's it. It's like I'm saying to say, like, what if you was naming like some some characters that you know I like more than you? You would be like, yeah, you know, like eight minutes, like eight, so some some. Like that was just the whole. I didn't think it was that big of a deal. I know you like T-Bone more than me. So I was just trying to give you the the credit that that's more just like you put that out there first, not me. Okay. Yeah, man, I don't, I don't freak with them, bro. I'm tired of the world government, bro. 
the Revolutionary Army them doing this, it's about to be lit. Cause they declare war on the Celestial Dragons. They all gotta react. All the world government. They about to tear shit up. I'm excited about that. Yeah, I'm, I can't see. I can't wait to see like exactly how this is gonna unfold. Uh, what it looks like. I want to see Dragon in action. I want to see Kobe. Uh, what's his name? Yeah, Kobe in action too. I don't know why I keep forgetting Sabo's name. I guess because I ain't said it or heard it in a minute, man. Yeah, I'm ready to see all of them in action, man, and uh, finally free these people from these corrupt kings and freaking celestial dragons and all the the, the uh, corrupt world government part. That part of that, all that. I want to be cleaned up. Dang. Everybody to be peace. What you think Kobe gonna do? Um, I feel like they're gonna attack the the corrupt part. So I think in that instance, he's he's gonna also come to that conclusion on like what's what's gonna be for the greater good. Like if, if he notices that they're taking out corrupt people, he's he's gonna either be okay with it or help us. Kind of like kind of like how he was kind of coming to terms with Marine Four. Like he was on the ring side, but his just his just like his like essence was just like. This is wrong. All this killing is wrong. Like, could we just stop? You know what I'm exactly. saying? Exactly. So yeah. And in that flashback, we saw him do the same thing. Mm -hmm. When he was just like, "I want to change. I want to be the world government. I want to do better. I want to mm -hmm. do better for people." So yeah, just gotta, just gotta, just gotta take out the old weeds. You know what I'm saying? The poison in there, and then back to good. That's gonna be. That's gonna be crazy. What you think, uh, Garp gonna do? I think Garp. I think Garp was gonna pretty much follow suit. Like, yeah. I mean, yeah, you probably disagree, but yeah, it's okay. I mean, if he the justice and pillar like y'all saying, then stick to your guns. That's all I'm saying. Same energy. Y'all see the hoodie. Do you think he changed his energy at all at any point in time? Hmm? You think he changed his energy at any point in time throughout the show? That's what I'm saying. Keep the same energy. He didn't change it. So don't energy. don't try to come to no defense or nothing. Keep fighting for the Celestial Dragons. The world government who we all protecting keep the same energy. Okay. You mean fight for you, your family. I think you, I think you have uh I think you have him pegged kinda wrong, but hey, it's fine. I'm not gonna get into that. So yeah, man, I'm excited, man. See what else gonna happen, y'all. Same here. This this beginning? Uh yeah. Right. Let's run this up. White beard. God damn. I'm sure you did build a greater for fortress. Is that the entrance? He told him to stay away. Hey. Kazaru. <laughs> is that T-Bone? That T-Bone, yeah. I couldn't come back his foot. This is not a Navy base. <laughs> That's dope. Sengoku. <laughs> He's like, yeah, you wanted my job. Semi retired. Came in focus. He came at my man. He just life, roasted man. said Goku. At Maria. Huh? Who is this? Is this the other new one? Get a new admiral. Ready to see what he what he about? He or she? I don't know. I'm not. I'm not. You know. Hey, my man, you gotta, hey, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta keep him cut. Never know if you run into some. Somehow. He tried to.
fling down the gauntlet. In one day? And Goku like, yep, not my problem no more. <laughs> he got his own paper shredder. Dang, that's it. Input down was cracking. Ah. <laughs> I'm trying to still alive. <sighs> it's just that I don't see us going back just to say bond time no time soon bro we put down was like the teamwork like we didn't know we needed yeah crocodile Jim day all the Luffy. villains and all the heroes together on time everybody was three bon time. Jelen was crazy, bro. Mm-hmm. It's fun. Whoa. He shot up with your orbs. Dang. This was no hockey like Luffy. Mm-hmm. And Luffy was fighting hard, bruh. Oh, shit. Mm. Damn, that stuff was painful to watch. Hey, Bonton, W man, but he stayed out there the whole time. Facts. Encourage this man, bruh. Dang, this is the first time seeing Jinbei. These were the good old days, man. Pre time skip. He <laughs> could tell Luke. Still can't tell him nothing, bro. You never give it up. Oh, man. I wonder why. Are <laughs> you shark? Man. Don't mess your makeup up, man. Dang! Trey Dolphy was there. Mihawk was there. I feel like they gotta have something on Mihawk. They gotta have something on him for him to just be willingly just signing up for this like this. When the Kang showed up. <laughs> Why <is it> here? <laughs> so... <laughs> it might be OP, bro. Somebody oh, that couldn't use hockey, bro, and still terrorizing like this? Oh, it's came to wreck it, bro. He set up for before. They was ready, boy. They like, oh damn, he coming. <laughs> it's crazy because we all um, it was it was like no no more than a year ago we watched this. Oh yeah. yeah, yeah. This ain't Jozu? Mm. My God. They couldn't even touch White Beard for a sec, but Messed up the ship, man. That was a crazy entrance, by the way. Oh, wow. Yeah, man, we got Sengoku reflecting on the past, man. 
seeing seeing Luffy's like yeah, like you think about it, it ain't been that long. My man just been climbing ranks, bro. It's ridiculous. Facts. It probably take people decades to get to where to where he was at. He, he just willy nilly doing it. And Goku was saying it like anytime Luffy do some miracles happen. Mm-hmm. It's happening so many times to the point where it's like he, you don't think he can take L's. Yeah, like that. So. I'm starting to think the. Like the will of D, anybody that has that in their name, it gotta have like some type of special thing inside their blood, I think. Because it's like, no matter if he was like a barista or like a like a doctor or something, I think they would have tried to kill Ace, regardless because he was the son of Goldie Roger. Yeah. And I think only Thanks. you only want to do that if it's something that could be like it's like it's like passed down through blood, but. I feel like anybody that got the D had got the D in their name has that it has it inside of them. So that's why anytime they find out about it, they always try to take it out. So maybe it's something like only they can like activate or achieve or something. That's why they don't want them to um to like be alive. But yeah. I mean won't they go out the law like that then? Do they not know? They didn't know law, remember? And because uh and, and uh, what's his name even told him to, to, to don't tell Doflamingo or any problems. Right. Mm-hmm. And so it's like... I still think they don't know. I still think they don't know. Yeah, but just like you said, like, it didn't matter. For Ace, it didn't matter because he was the son. He had the blood. Yeah. So, you know what I'm saying? But it That's kind of like automatic confirmation that he's a D. And, he's, and he was causing... Like, I feel like it was more so he was... Like, if they run across a D, they just gonna kill him. Yeah. But the fact you got Ace, once they found out about who he was, even his pirate status was making him even more of a target because yeah. he was whipping the range, you know what I'm saying? So they was kind of seeing him progress, like, oh, hell no, we got to cut this off. Kind of yeah. like that. So, so I think that's why it was so focused on him, you know? Yeah. They was mopping him, man, like I said, anyway. It was stupid. You know what I'm saying? But hey, they want to just kill, you know, innocent people because of their names. That's another reason why they trash. But anyway, Cole, I like seeing the, um, just kind of like the flashback. It was cool seeing White Bear too. Um, just pull Bon Chan. Bon Chan. Just nostalgia <sighs> of everything coming back full, kind of full circle on how Luffy's got, like, getting to where he's getting to. And what Oda has taken away from us. Facts. I feel like Bon Chan might be a straw hat in the future. Be mad if you him. think about it, would he still have his crew? We didn't really get to know his crew that personally, so his crew might be gone because he's an impel down by himself. So I could see him either join a revolutionary army or actually becoming a straw hat because of him and Luffy's relationship. And I'm fine with that. Would not be mad at that at all. You know what I'm saying? Also, I think this is the first time we kind of see like the resemblance of like Luffy and dragon like his father it's like luffy's been known for declaring wars on the navy and uh in his lobby and with robin the marine four with ace and all that and i was dragging him it's like taking a stance to like declare that that big declare you know what i'm mm -hmm. saying and so like father like son you know what i'm saying so it's dope it's dope to see that but yeah man we get to the next episode see what else gonna happen same here You think Luffy beating Kazaru? Kazaru? Nah. You think? No. <laughs> he pissed off at Kazaru. <laughs> like, got your goddamn family. This is one of my favorite moments. Yeah. Luffy talking to Whitebeard. It's crazy because we would have saw ASL before this. All of this would have hit even harder. Mm. Look, he have his hockey, man.
<laughs> what the cockroaches? Luffy <laughs> was not playing, bro. <laughs> Man's passed up. This transmission be reminding me of like an old movie, like some type of martial arts movie. Mm. This is uh this is part was so cold. You see the chains fall. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah. Made the white beer logo. Yes, sir. Eesh, the animation. Look at boy. That was our mission. He only doing that cause he cause he can't stop him. Right. That lining though, what the hell? That's Steve Harvey. That old school. This was the biggest right here issue. It's crazy because you would have thought hockey would have been used a lot more during this during this battle. Especially with all the people that was here. Yeah. See, bad blood. Hey, bro. Hey, man, this is crazy, man. Yeah, that's I don't know. Horrible thing about parents. They don't want to, they don't never want to see their child die before them. Right. But kids, I thought like kids be the same way. They don't want to see their parents die. Dang! <laughs> the smile, bro. Oh, crazy. Jumping my mans. What you gonna do, Doc? Yeah, beat up my freaking niggas. Ain't do nothing for the whole freaking war. <laughs> You don't believe in it? Somebody must have heard him back in the day. Damn. <laughs> about to be a Marine Ford for part two. Dang, they got them freaking protected. They is not playing. Red port. Wow. That's easy to go to go to the new world now. They say about to see all the royals. Let me get some money. Stuck your stuff in it. Yeah, alcoholic problem. <laughs> he look like that 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 Hispanic dude that play in all the movies. Oh, I know you talking about Pre President Lincoln with the hat and the pistols. Oh yeah, lord. Okay. Garp is here. Did he maybe assist him? He showed up, huh? Oh, well, was he on guard duty for them, maybe? Guard? Yeah. All right. Uh, we don't care. Uh, go back to guard. They mom dream coming true, though. Yep. Dang. 
He had to be accompanying them, yeah. He's their guard duty. Kitty about to come out. Damn, we saw guard. That's crazy. Yeah, for the first time since uh Hey, mm -hmm. Who is that? This is the Admiral. Oh, that's the other Admiral. Oh, snap. You wanna fight me? He gonna be on a revolutionary side, man, too. I think his color gonna be... What was, what was the other thing? Damn, it was something about the colors. He asked about green and orange. Completed something incredible. What color are you trying to say before we see? So I can see it. I say uh, green or orange. Green or orange. I can't remember what the color scheme was, but it was like lavender. I think it's lavender, green, or orange. Still fast, man. For three years. How the hell you ain't eat for three years? Damn, I'm interested. Three years? What happened three years ago? Did we know? It's probably just some new stuff that we just don't know about. Hey, another admiral. Another admiral. Garb showed up. See Rahoshi here. Yep. Is it? That's, that's crazy. This war about to be wild. This I'm ready to see this meeting. I want to see what's about to go down. Oh yeah, that too. Ready to sit down. I'm ready to see what they about to talk about. That too. You know what I'm saying? That's interesting. This man talking. About we don't need the warlords no more. It's about to, what are you gonna do? Everybody about to. They gotta choose a side. I feel like people like Kobe, Esho. Like once the revolutionaries come through, like it's gonna we. I don't know. I don't know what they're gonna do. I think it's gonna depend. I don't know. I'm excited though. Yeah, everybody here the reverie is about to go down. Facts. New Admiral, you know, I owe the be freaking um, leave him black and white until he's ready to reveal him and shoot him. I'm excited. It was a color scheme thing that I was trying to, that's all I was trying to remember. Cause I remember the primary colors and then it was something with the, it was like purple, green and... Color scheme from what? It, it was, it's, it's called something. I can't remember what it's called though. It's like, it's, there's a particular color, color table and I think the next one in line is supposed to be uh, like green. I can't remember what it is. Mm. Oh, yeah, yeah, okay. But yeah, he lucky looked at like one of the uh, Fishman Island uh, brother. With the hair? Yeah. Yeah. He ain't eating in three years. Who can go without eating for three years? What can go without eating for three years? I don't think he, he asked about it could be a robot because he he asked about Vegapunk. Yeah, I didn't get to see that part. He asked, he's like, he's like, what's Vegapunk been up to? And Isha was like, I ain't get a chance to see it, but it's something incredible. Oh, that's why he. I think that's why he's talking about we don't need the warlords. And then they, after that, he said we don't need the warlords. Ooh, snap! I don't know. But yeah, it can't be human, bro. Because humans can't last. Even fishermen, they gotta eat. It gotta be something. Like three years gotta be some type power of power. The robot is or something like he might be have something. He said if he found a girl, she might be able to help him. Yeah, so he's a ladies' dude. What if he a vampire? Hmm. Still faster. Vampires just become weak, I guess, if they don't eat. They yeah. still live. Yeah. And a lady to help him, he could take her blood. Yeah. Hey man. Yeah, two, bat. Two new, two new goddamn admirals, bro. We ain't seen Ayokuji yet. Ah, uh, he go freaking be fighting for revolutionaries, bro. Wait, what is Kizaru? Did that mess up the color scheme though? If Kizaru's still there? Yeah, Kizaru's yellow, so he already has yellow. But, if, you, but if you need a new set. That doesn't mean something need to have to happen to him or he got to get promoted or something or move somewhere or something. A new set? Yeah. A new set of colors? Yeah, it'd be weird to have primary then go to that other one I was talking about, but Kazaru's still there. I'm just saying. Because, I mean, Isho is purple, right? Yeah. So it got the yellow, purple, and then 
What's the other color that fit into the? Uh, I can't remember what it's called. But I think it, I think it's gonna be, I think it's orange or green, but I can't remember. Mm. I'm I'm uh, I'm gonna look it up. Hey, a lot of stuff, man. I'm excited. You know what I'm saying? Hope y'all enjoyed the episode. You know what I'm saying? I feel yeah. Like no. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, because when you connect each one, it gives you it gives you other colors. When you put them together. Uh, red and blue, each show. Red and yellow, orange, or uh, yellow and blue, green. So the next ones are green and orange. But I don't know how Kizaru fits in there if he's still there. That's what I was trying to remember because they connect. Boom, 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 like that. Yeah. You did that. You ever do that in school? Mixed colors and like. Yeah. I, I used to. Have, you, you ever had the color the crayon box, sixty four pack with the sharpener inside? You was the man if you had that one. We had a whole art class in the paint, and we had to like combine colors to just make new colors and had tests and stuff. I freaking on. love art. Art was yeah. like one of my favorite subjects. The yeah. teachers, the teachers always show me favoritism because I was pretty good. I used to have like side projects, and I, I and, and I wasn't doing like uh, uh like the the regular art school homework. Everybody else had homework, and my project was to do a three D model of, of, a, of a house. It was a high school. He needs to be fired. It was a dude. He, he looked just like um, the lead singer from um, what is that? What is that rock? Well, I don't know if they call it rock, but they Maroon Five. Mm. He looked just like him. Shouts out oh. to you, man. If you if you ever see this, man, he's one of my favorite teachers, bro. Adam Levine. Yeah, him. Yeah. He looked just like him, but he's an art teacher. My man, my man, my man didn't have me doing no work, and I got an A. Oh my gosh, man! But he was trying to further develop my my love for architecture because I because I wanted to be an architect at the beginning, like when I first before I got to college, like I want to be. I actually went to college. I want to be an architect at first, but they tell me I was gonna be there for five years. I was like, not happening. And then I ended up being there for five years anyway. Shape. So yeah, that happened. But I'm but I'm but I'm glad for the track I, I picked. So I'm cool. Thanks, man. That's what's up. That's what's up. But yeah, uh, I think that's it, man. Hope y'all enjoyed it. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Make sure y'all check these videos out on our Patreon before we put them on YouTube. Facts. Don't check it out. Peace. Deuces.